Hey, good morning, Bill. Ethan Colm here at Alderman's Toyota, where your satisfaction is our top priority. Um, I wanted to thank you for coming in the other day and taking a look at our RAV4s. Um, what I got for you in this one is that one I sent you an email about. This is the uh, 2024, uh, 2021 rather, RAV4 uh, LE. Um, so this is kind of the entry level, but this one does have a couple different options, kind of distinguishing it from the rest of the other ones. Um, as you can see, it's finished in the magnetic gray metallic color. This is a 2.5 liter four cylinder um, with an all wheel drive uh, uh, layout and also an eight speed automatic transmission. Um, from the front, the headlights are a little different. Those, uh, they have like those reflectors inside there, um, but I still think they're uh, LED. Coming over to the right here too, uh, brand new tires. Literally, this vehicle has 10,000 miles on them, so you can see nothing going on there. Um, I like the color on this one. It's As you can see, this vehicle is absolutely filthy, but the magnetic gray metallic color actually hides that dirt pretty well. Um, this has color keyed mirrors, uh, breakaway mirrors, and with the uh, blinkers built right in. And you also have the blind spot monitoring, which is a package on this vehicle. Uh, coming out to the back, um, you just have normal lock and unlock with a physical key. I'll flip out for us right there. Um, lift up the back here. In the back, you have the all weather floor mat. Really nice to have. And of course, your spare and all the tools. Same sort of stuff as the uh, RAV4 we saw the other day, just in a little bit of a different package. Uh, the interior is relatively unchanged, except this one now has the black interior. All weather floor mats in the back. There's a little cubby there instead of having the uh, rear venting uh, as well. Um, again, fold down, 60-40 fold, a little bit of recline, not a crazy amount. Um, right here is the vehicle's information as well as the car facts. Um, let me go through and kind of present you this. So looking at this, uh, as you can see, um, this vehicle has had $929 worth of labor put into it. Um, uh, all the stuff, air, oil filters, state inspections and cleaning. Um, even though it only had 10,000 miles on it, it's had all the recommended maintenance done um, for the uh, time. This vehicle has a one over, one owner off lease um, from here. You can see it has that 10,237 miles on it. I'll show you the odometer statement, but a personal lease, three rare. Um, anyways, taking a look from the back seat, Largely unchanged is the way the interior looks, um, except again, this one has the uh, different colors here. Um, it's all black. You have that nice stripping along there, soft touch materials here. Um, up there, you do not have the wireless Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. It is wired on this one. Um, and I'll show you a little bit more uh, what makes this different from the one we drove the other day. Let me hop up into the front seat now. And again, leg room is the same. Um, again, I'm a six foot tall guy. That's a lot of leg room right there. Physical key, no proximity lock and unlock. Um, but again, unlock the vehicle with a button here, flip out the key and uh, manual adjustable seats, really nice bolstering. Um, let's hop in. 10,261 miles on this vehicle, which for a Toyota is brand new. Um, inside here, you just have your normal climate control. Um, turn on the fan, adjust the here. Temperature with this one, different modes right here in the middle. Front and rear defroster. Um, traction control button down here. Um, and with the, um, the, the gas version, you do have the uh, snow modes, mud and sand, rock and dirt modes, as well as eco, normal, and sport modes for the vehicle. Um, reverse camera, as you can see right there. And a sport mode to go through and do engine braking or select whatever gear you'd like to be in with the eight speed automatic transmission. Um, up here, your SOS functions, door functions right there. 
Um, also, you do have daytime running lights on this vehicle. Um, this does have lane departure and radar cruise control. Um, so you still do get those nice functions as well as the pre-collision detection um, on this vehicle. I'm gonna go through, turn on the headlights. Oh, of course, blind spot monitoring right there and there, which is an added on addition to the LE grade of this vehicle. Automatic high beams as well. From the back here, classic um, RAV4 design language with those nice accenting on the um, taillights there. And you also do get to see that this is an all wheel drive vehicle. Let me give you another angle back over here. Chrome tipped exhausts. I like the uh, possibility to add a roof rack right here. No need to drill anything. Um, right here is the information on the vehicle right here in case I missed anything. Again, low mileage right there. Selling price is that 27. Um, again, walking up with a quick little angle of the vehicle. And check out the uh, LED headlights. Again, the RAV4 is a very nice, sharp looking vehicle. And again, um, this 2021 model is still the same uh, exterior wise. Um, anyways, Bill, thank you so much for your time. Thank you for so much for watching this video. If you'd like to learn more about pricing and availability, I'll leave a link down below in the description to our website where you can find out more about that. Um, also, if you'd like to take it for a test drive, come on down to Route 7 South here in Rutland. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.